So I wanted to show you a few tricks that you can use in BandLab or in Soundtrap or any other audio recording software that you use. You could do this in GarageBand. If you have it, you could do it in Audacity. Um, I've got two tracks here. One is an acoustic guitar track and one is a blank melody track. So I'm going to record the melody, but I'm going to do it in chunks. That's right. I'm going to do it in a couple of different takes. You don't have to play it all the way through perfectly. That's what the pros do in the studio. So I've got my metronome set at 80 beats per minute. I'm in 3-4 time and my metronome is on. Uh, this track is armed and I'm going to go to the beginning and I'm going to hit the uh, record button or the uh, letter R key on my keyboard. So here we go. I'm happy with that. I'm going to pick it up now, right here, at the end of this phrase. Oh, so I made this little loop thing there. If you uh, click up on the timeline here, you can get a little repeat, that little red thing that just appeared. I made it go away by clicking on it. So I want to jump in my recording right here. That's where I want it to pick up. So. I'm going to hit here. Now I have a rest in the sheet music, okay? So don't do this in the middle of a complicated phrase. Uh, a rest is a great place to punch yourself in. So here we go. I'm going to pick it up and have the second phrase. Once again, I'll stop right there. Now let's listen back to see what that sounds like. Can't even tell that I took a second take there. So let's finish it up. And maybe, maybe I'll make a mistake this time. Here we go. I have two choices here. I can just delete that and do it again, or I can decide to punch myself in right here on that bad note. Here's how that works. So I popped in a brand new section that overwrote the wrong note that I played. So here's the whole thing together. So you can continue like this through your whole piece until you get a take that you are happy with and you put it all together and then export it. So good luck doing little punch-ins and recording your piece in sections.